So, ha! Boop! Eee! Hi, everybody. I have another haul. One, I have the second, hopefully, last part of my haul. How's it going? I have a Ross haul, and hopefully it's the last part of my haul, but we never know. This is me talking. Huh? I got just a few things. For eBay haul, DSW, Rue 21, Ulta, and Disneyland. Forever 21, DSW. <laughs> Russ, 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 Russ. I had to get back to my roots today. And Macy's. Let's get into it. I'll start with Forever 21. Ah! Um, so first I picked up, hope that's not in the way, this shirt that says Cold Night Warm Heart and it's pajamas. And then it came with these shorts. This was $9.99 and these are the shorts. I got this dress and it says Pillow Fight Champion, and I found this shirt. It says, oh, creep. <laughs> and I'm like, that's perfect. I got a bunch of hair ties. A bunch of hair ties. 5, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. 30 hair ties. That should last me a month, right? And I got this lint roller. In price. It was $1.90, and so were the hair ties. And then I got some tweezers, which were $3.90. So we went back to my work. Um, these were 50% off, $12.94. Then I got 30% off that, so they were five bucks. Yeah, almost five bucks. So these are Kelly and Katie socks. And let's open them up, see how tall they are. They're not tall at all. This is great. Oh, and boop. These polka dot ones. And I'm not gonna lie, these polka dot ones look cute. So I got this new Urban Decay Afterglow 8 Hour Powder Blush in the color score. Let's see if I can open this. I can't open it. I am not smart. I don't want to ruin the packaging. Why did I not just grab the scissors from my desk? Because it's me. You know me. Yeah, why didn't I just get the scissors? I hurt my tooth doing that. Still not that easy. So easy. You just wrapped me. Can't complain. Finally. Oh, I always love the inside of Urban Decay packaging. So, this is the color score, as in I scored, and it's like a peachy color. Open. And it's got a nice shimmer. Now that I look at it, it kind of looks exactly like my Bella Bomba blush. I was trying to get not my Bella Bomba blush. What you guys think? It's like a peachy version of Bella Bomba, but looking at it in the pan, it looks like Bella Bomba exactly. I forgot about this, but I got the Urban Decay Alice in Wonderland palette. This is not new. This is used, but... I figured something I had to have. And that's what it looks like. It came with a black pencil. I put my own purple pencil in there. And yeah. So there's from eBay from Disneyland. I got this bracelet that says Amber and it has Mickey ears on it. It's a simple little chain bracelet. We, my best friend and I, Went to Ulta. This woman helped me pick out this Japanese concealer, and this is in shade one. And it's called the Velvet Touch Concealer. And buying this got me a duo for free. So that is what the concealer looks like in the packaging. This is the eyeshadow. It is in shade four. I was looking in the sale section because that's my favorite section and there was OPI on sale and I was looking for the San Francisco collection because I'm like 
if they have any from the San Francisco collection, that would be perfect, because I need the rest of that collection anyway. And they did. They had Keeping Susie at Bay. And it was four seventy five instead of nine fifty. And it was uh it was a clearance off of that, so it was actually two dollars for a almost ten dollar nail polish. Yeah. Rue twenty one. And I got some jewelry. All of these earrings for eight ninety nine. I like it because it's like there's some backings that are gold, there are some backings that are silver, and then it's a, it's a bunch of different style earrings. I like it. And there's peace signs, and there's, and I also got this bunch of bracelets, and these were, I think, five or six dollars, and they look like this, and I got this shirt, and it is high-low. And the back is like just a normal tank, and in the I mean the front is a normal tank, and in the back you have this bow and this little kind of black and white print. And I got these shorts, and these shorts were by the way the shirt was um, three dollars, and these shorts were fourteen or fifteen dollars. These are really comfortable and really soft. And I love them. We went to DSW. Lastly, I got this bag. I've been looking at this bag for a while. It is a Steve Madden bag. Uh, I got it for about $37. I got my Steve Madden flats. And I got some heels. I got these mixed number six heels. These were $15.73 instead of um, the original price was $44.94 and then they were 50% off for $22.47 and then I got 30% off of that. Six, 74 and so the final price was 15.73 for these mix number no. six heels um, in the sarti style in the light yellow color and seven and a half. So <coughs> this is what they look like. They look kind of like a butterfly, and they're so cute. I love them, and they're like cushioned on the inside. So I'm excited. And then the second thing was these Steve Madden flats. Where did my receipt go? They were twenty seven ninety six and then I had thirty percent off. So it was three fifty nine or an extra three fifty nine off. So my final price was eight thirty nine for these adorable flats. These are the wrong way. And they're cute. And I got this dress. It is it was fifteen dollars it's strapless, my favorite, and it's got see-through around the stomach, but it's flattering, and it's pretty short and flowy, but it's so beautiful. These shoe stretchers, expand shoes for comfort and relief for my flats, my heels, definitely. Yeah, so they were $6.99, and this shoe comfort kit, ball of foot cushion, three came with a set of three little cushions. Uh, this was $5.99. So a shoe comfort kit, ball of foot cushion, long lasting comfort, stays in place. Remove adhesive backing and place in four foot area of shoe with sticky side down. Sure steps, prevents heel slipping. Uh, make a certain that your soles are clean and dry. Press firmly in position for best adhesion. Allow 24 hours to step before using shoes. Hug my heels. Think this is what I need um, because I keep slipping out of my heels. Prevents heel slippage. Uh, improve shoe fit. Remove adhesive backing. Place product at inside back of shoe with sticky side down. And I uh, will see you guys in my next video. Bye! And I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you in my next video. Bye! And I'll see you guys very soon. Bye! And I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you in my next one.